Eyebrows are being raised tonight over $100,000 earmarked for the EVA Historical Society. It's a nonprofit that Representative Rita Cabania controls. The controversy centers around the upkeep for this EVA cemetery, which is why Cabania says she sought the funds. Now, the EVA lawmaker and her staff are also listed as officers, but Cabania says that she did not hide anything and she plans to distance herself from the group. I don't believe that I violated any law because the conflict of interest comes when you get paid. I never was paid. I don't intend to get paid, neither are my staff. We put their, their names for structure, and I hope that this all this hoopla about this nonprofit doesn't deter the release of the money because the community needs that money. House leaders say that the attorney general is looking into the matter and assure that no money will be dispersed until the budget office completes its due diligence and gives its approval that everything is above board. The nonprofit had its 501c3 status revoked last year, but Cabanilla says that she has verification that the nonprofit is in good standing.